With the May SAT score released, I know a lot of you are frustrated with your score being way lower than what you expected. This is actually really common and I'm going to explain how to fix this. The only reason why you thought you did so much better is because you actually got a lot more questions wrong on the test than you thought. I've seen students tell me I think I only got 5 or 6 questions wrong. Then the score comes back and they actually miss 20 plus questions and end up with something like a 1300. This happens because there's a gap between what feels right and what's actually right. To fix this, you have to build a clear system that tells you when your answer is truly correct, not just when it feels right. In other words, you need to create conditions for yourself so that when you meet these conditions, you can be 100% sure you got the question correct. For example, in grammar, don't just pick what sounds best. You can't be 100% confident that you got the question correct unless you pick the answer based on a specific grammar rule you know really well. In reading comprehension, don't just pick the answer that makes the most sense to you. Instead, verify your answer by finding evidence for your answer in the text directly and make sure the other answer choices are definitely wrong. That way you can be 100% confident you got the question correct. You can create conditions for yourself like these for every type of question on the SAT. So if your score surprised you in a bad way, the best thing you can do right now is spend time figuring out conditions like these that work for you. Conditions that make sure you are 100% sure your answer is actually correct. Then all that's left to do is to practice reaching these conditions faster and faster.